time I put these to my eyes, Brady's got a camera in my face. Yeah, it's a little different of the trade shows we're used to. We went to the outdoor retail show, which is like all those backcountry um, like hikers and what we would call granolers or hippies like it was their kind of outdoor show um, but the brands that they use obviously you know have unbelievable crossover to what they could be used for in the hunting world we backcountry hunt and, and backpack hunt all the time so like a lot of the research they do and a lot of the materials they use a lot of the stuff that they have is is very um, you know very applicable for hunters couldn't really tell people you were a hunter. Like you just kind of had to pass by, but we stuck out like a sore thumb. I mean, we were all wearing hunting gear, hunting backpacks, things like that. They're all seam sealed, and tight, and yeah. waterproof. And Do you know where Big Agnes is by chance? Yeah. Walk by about this one? Yeah, <laughs> I can't walk you there, but I've been there. Is it is how that? far from here? Not far. That's our one. What time is it? Um, 12, uh, 12 10. So we have like, this is a good time to like explore right now. You should probably over here. You should probably introduce, you should probably introduce yourself to our rep over there. Just to, just Cascade Designs. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah, go ask. What's her name? I'll go ask. Yeah, so it's his first trade show. Seth's like so dependable. He's like a little bit of a quieter guy. It's so funny though watching the interaction between like Seth and like Lorenzo and Trail. And Brady, they go fall in love with something, and who's the one that has to go follow up, get all the dealer paperwork, and put the actual order in? Seth's gotta go worry about getting them paid, getting the paperwork filled out, getting credit references. Cash it. Dude. Oh, yeah. Hell yeah! yeah. That's a little bit. Dude, that's badass. Um, typically, it's too there. Dude. He's gotta so, carry these. Yeah, I mean, be out for a full range. Ultralight air mats to ultralight self inflating these guys right here. Based on comfort, weight, and durability, it's hard to beat. Right. So, um, yeah, it's kind of a no brainer. People will pay for that because they know it. And, yep. uh, you know, word of mouth uh, gets around quickly in our tight little industry. So, yeah. you know, <laughs> consumers can only find to get. Like we're a company that uses our product and it designs product based on what we want to use because we, like, we don't want to make something that we're like, that's dumb. <laughs> that you don't want to use. Yeah. Uh, we met with a lot of the guys that we already carry. Like we met with uh, MSR, we met with Big Agnes, we met with uh, C to Summit, we met with a couple of those guys, but then we, we want to bring on Hillebrick. So we met with them about their tents and their shelters. Yeah, we met with a, a lot of guys that are kind of on the top of their game with what they do. Black Diamond is another one. Prana uh, materials and, and clothing, so it was fun. Easier in and out for your bag, as well as you can sit up in your bag and you don't get that weird toga going on. So it's another, just another comfort feature to it. Well, one question not here. Where are we gonna be with Blair against this wall? This is the guy I was telling you about who was hey. just oh, going, yeah. going nuts uh, about uh, bringing you guys on. This awesome. is Lorenzo, our president. How's it nice going? Nice to meet you. Yeah. Trail, you met Seth over yep, to the yep. store, yeah, yeah. and then Brady. Made from antelope? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> just call. No, but we actually, we've looked at bison down before. Really? Yeah, so bi bison actually have these like insulating uh, fibers beneath their hide, um, and you can collect and pull it up. Um, but fortunately, it's not super locked, so we, we'd only ever make it maybe babies or something like that. So, uh, really, really tough uh, material, and still, you know, very weight efficient. And then the uh, the really big heavy duty stuff is the Bore Windstock, and that's what we have just behind us. I'll pull out the, the Puma here. This is Trail's favorite show of the year. He usually goes, he somehow gets a pass and goes as like a consumer. This is the first time that he goes for actually work related, not just pure personal use. He's a riot watching him walk around. Trail, we're talking about tents, why are you talking about a chair right now? You know, and he, then he just gets up and he moves around and starts touching everything. What's that way? Hmm, I'd run that. He's a sicko when it comes to gear. He's a sicko, which is fantastic for Gohan. So yeah, they will source this through like hunters that have hunted this exact unit that are sharing information. So they're not talking about secret hunting spots, but they're talking about very factual based information, access points. 
this is all historical temperature precipitation from inside the unit, not like a nearby city. Come on, Trail. You got it. I don't think I got the grip. <laughs> Come on, Trail. He's trying to. He wants to. I really want to. <laughs> He thinks if he rips one, you'll give him a free tent to, to right. keep him shut. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> yeah, not gonna happen. Wow. Almost all of our brands in that building were the only hunting retailer. We're the only hunting customer. But um, but going there and sourcing the best stuff and putting it in one spot is it's we're doing a lot of the legwork, which is cool. And did you want that co-branded on the pouch? Is that is it on the what? Pouch? You can do your brand logo on the outside of this pouch. We can do half black, half tile. There's a couple things we walked away with that we're like really excited about. Uh, although small, because backcountry hunters, we need all those little small gear items. Um, but we walked away with making some pretty, pretty good orders. Yeah, everyone behaved themselves. Trail kind of, I think, wanted to spend seven days there instead of the two days we were there. I mean, every, every time I walked by a booth, he would touch things and grab it and like, hey, what about this? Let's go look at this thing. Porter will love these. Porter, you'll love this. I know you will. This is, is this one? There's of adjustment, mm. but it's just a little bit easier of a push button setup. So it's still five section, full carbon, but instead of 199, you're at 219 pair. And you know, black carbon, but same pole shaft, same locking system. Well, break it, Trail. <laughs> I haven't broken one. He Never. almost broke my. Uh, Remember, you extended the Voyager out yeah. too far, the twist lock. No, in. that was me. <laughs> that was someone else. <laughs> now we did that. Did you did you repair it? Are you right there. At, um, you sent it back for warranty work. No, I oh. sent it. I sent oh, it back. That's right. He's ready. He's good to go. Hanging on his mantle as a trophy. <laughs>